going to Palm Springs. Day two on the road trip. Comment below whether you think Brennan can beat up a bear. <laughs> Watch me dip. I challenge you. It is early in the morning. Is it? It's like 6 15. Ew, I look like that. I know, I do too. And we're getting ready to board our flight to Denver, which is then going to take us to Palm Springs. We'll see you on the plane. We'll tell you more about it. from Colorado. <laughs> you want to go fly the plane? No. Is that cool? Yeah. It's very cool. I love it. Are you found your seat? This is supposed to be my seat. I got the window seat, but Katie always sits in my window seat. Oh, but she, she's the one like planning and ordering everything, so it's not even like I have a say. <laughs> I didn't make these fun. But they gave me the window seat. So I'm gonna tell the flight attendant that you're sitting in my seat. And then I'm gonna be like, rip me off the seat. <laughs> and she would be able to fry my cold. Oh, Dead my All right, that's enough. <laughs> it takes a little too far. It's just a window seat. <laughs> All right, we are on the plane. Oh, we're going to sleep the whole you. time. Says you. <laughs> we're going to sleep the whole time. We're going out to California, but we're going to Palm Springs because oh, Katie... What? There's her ring. There it is. Katie is a member of the Lego Heart Squad, and we get to finally go out and meet all the other members of the Heart Squad, which we're pretty jazzed about. Let me see if I can remember all of them. Nicole, Jordan... <laughs> Sophie, Katie, and Katie. That's you. As it's say. Oh, and Michael. And Michael. Are you like All right, we'll meet them. You guys hopefully will see them in the vlog, but we'll see. All right. Okay, good morning. It's another day in which to excel. We're gonna have another great day. It's day, what day is this, Ryan? Day three, the day three. crazy adventure? Actually, no. Four. If we count the days of the four seasons, it's uh, day four. Day four. The day we arrived, but was day, if the day we arrived was day one, this is day four. Got it. This is day two on the road trip, though. Day two on the road trip, day four on the, on the... Can I show them the, the view up at like? Yeah, please do. Hey, so we're getting out of here. Today's gonna be a great day. We're up here at Glacier National, and, uh, we got up here on one taking gas, which is great. The vehicle did beautifully, very comfortable. Got us here nice and safe. We're heading up to the lodge at Glacier, we're and we're like, gonna see. Should we settle for the hotel? Or should we just go for it? We're just like, man, everything's going great. We'll just go for it. So we just went for it. <laughs> that was the right decision. So we're looking forward to a great day. Brennan's gonna take you out front to show you the lake. The view is insane. unbelievable. Our and uh, our sunrise. We're off and running. It is 8.08. Glacier National Park. It is 10.08 back home and it is 5.08 in California. That's Ryan's. Good morning, Glacier. Good morning. Ryan and Brennan trying to decide whether um, they could beat a... No, I'm saying a bear would beat Brennan in a fight. No, Brennan's like betting on humans to beat bears. I'm I saying, take a I'm bear saying would if the bear is my height If it's a grizzly bear and it gets up on his like hind legs, he's 10 feet. If the bear is Easy. my height or shorter, standing up like this, standing up on his legs, so probably a baby. Mm -hmm. I could beat him. You could beat a baby what, bear? Could beat a baby bear. <laughs> Good job. I could... Good but job. it's a bit. Okay, here's the thing. He's saying, he's saying Conor McGregor could beat have teeth or claws. Like Comment below whether you think Brennan could beat up a bear. No, 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 no. no. Bears easily beat Brennan. This, no. is, this, think is, about the, this is the argument. This is the argument. Conor McGregor. Could Conor McGregor beat a bear? Because he's a UFC fighter. He's got the kicks. He's got the punches. He's got the punches. Conor McGregor could beat a bear. He's got the kicks. He's got the punches. Conor McGregor could easily. Conor, if it's you're like watching this, bro, I've got you in a fight with a bear. Floyd Money Mayweather. A thousand times out of a thousand. Okay, here we are at the Glacier Lodge. It's beautiful. We just walked in this after. Is what, this is what the bear thinks of it. Right, right. After the Plywood Palace, we walked in here. It's beautiful. This is right on the lake. Sir, how do you feel about this up and coming fight? <laughs> I see, I see. Do you think you could beat Conor McGregor? Look, 
His mouth? Look yeah, at that small little mouth. No, <laughs> dude, dude, no, that, that's a cop, that's a cop. So, exactly. A it's big like my, It's like my height. An Alaskan grizzly. Yes, good. If he pees like this tall, he'd like eat oh. me. That's no, I'm not talking about you. I'm He's about All right, guys, so the new bet is uh, John Cena. And like, can the bear see him? Because I don't think he can see John Cena. But still, an invisible John Cena, bear, I'm still taking the bear. I'm saying Randy Orton could be the bear. All right, let's jump back into that Chrysler Pacifica and head up the Going to the Sun Road. What a cool name uh, for a road, Going to the Sun Road. Yeah, right there. Look at him. Look at the beast. Look at that absolute unit. What did, what did we decide it was? Did he go? All right, so we're trying to set up a good picture. There's Ray, there's Mr. Hooper. Check out that beautiful waterfall. Huh? Yes, it's perfect. Actually, that's perfect. Let's practice a little bit. Yeah, doors open is good. Snack run just outside of Missoula, midday. Well, we already like, have the snacks, we're just uh, repurposing them. Brian, Ray, yes, we snacked up, gassed up. Do you have any uh, tape? No. And we're out. We good? Let's get out of here. Can we unload any of the boxes right now? South to Idaho. Bam. Somebody comes by? Horn, horn, right? Yeah, yeah, back yeah. off here. Uh, oh. So you <laughs> <I> <laughs> No, this is a second uh, okay. So here is Ryan's penny. Okay. All right, so Mr. Hooper. There's a thing. This is Ryan's penny on the left side of the track. That is my penny on the right side of the track. So. Okay. Uh, yeah. So there's a thing. If you put a penny on a uh, railroad, railroad track, and the train comes by, it just absolutely flattens it, just demolishes it. So we saw a train. We were like, why not? So we rode the tracks for like two miles. We got really far ahead of it, and now we're putting the pennies on. We're just waiting for the train. So it should be coming out could, there. We could either be waiting for seconds, or we could be waiting for hours. <laughs> no. Oh, it's coming down the track. It's going for minutes. So usually, if a train's coming, you'll like hear it in the track because it like rumbles. But we think the train took an alternate track. <laughs> Great job, so we got one, can't find the other one, but we have one, and that is a lucky penny now. Yep. For Raymond, right? Do you think we can, oh. Okay. Right. Oh. <laughs> right, so let's jump back into Pacifica and head south. Do you think this is still worth anything? Well, it's illegal to do. Seriously. Oh. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh. 
Why are we videoing this? your back's up. All right, Katie and I arrived. You guys saw the beautiful resort we're staying in, and it's time for lunch. It's a Baja salad with chicken. I said Baja. I didn't mean to say it like that. <laughs> it's a Baja. Baja salad with chicken. We each got one. This is a huge salad. Holy cremole. But it is, what, 3 o'clock for us at home already? Mm. I'm not going to keep playing that game, but it is. It's 3 o'clock for us. Why not? I don't know. You like to play that game? I do? Yeah. It's fun. How much does it mix it? With your, I don't know. Should I pour this on? I don't, I'm going to dip mine because I don't want to use all the dressing. Dip yours? Yeah, because look how much dressing's in there. Look how much dressing's in there. That's a lot of, so if I take a bite, I might dip a little bit into the dressing. We might not even need the dressing. Look at all the stuff that's on it. Dip, you can't dip a salad. I do it all the time. I don't think that you can. <laughs> Watch me dip. I challenge you. Watch me dip. Watch me nay nay. Watch me dip, no, dip. Stop. Watch me nay nay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh I know, it makes Katie so happy. It tastes like um, Cafe Rio. Mmm, our favorite. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, holy cow, here we are. The Pacifica and Mr. Hooper driving now, performing beautifully. These gentlemen, very comfortable in the back. We are out uh, in Idaho right now. We're going out, we just checked into the hotel. Beautiful Friendor. resort. And um, we're going to the grocery store. I, we have a kitchen in our beautiful room, so we're gonna, um, I think, go to the grocery store and have men prepare dinner, which could be interesting. So stay tuned and um, wonder what they're doing at Palm Springs. All right, you guys, it is now the afternoon. Katie and I, I, we didn't vlog at all our laying out at the pool. Because there was like eight million degrees and the camera would have Right. <laughs> I think that's probably what would have happened. It was really hot. I, look, I actually have clothes on. There we go. Um, it was really hot out there. It was it was 101 degrees, which is nothing compared to what's going to be tomorrow. 105. I'm liking it though. It's cool. This so this weird. you should go the other way. All right. So this is our room. Would you like to see our room? It's our room. It's a little messy. We've got some of Katie's outfits laid out. Um, Ew. Oh, it's nice. there we go. <laughs> Much better. Here we go. Here we are. Notice I'm wearing the same outfit that I wore at home. To the wedding. The wedding. I know, it's a great outfit. And I opened the curtains. Ah! Before. I broke the little thing. Oh, is that bad? Yeah. Hey, look, at, look outside our door though. Come here. Oh, yeah. Isn't this a, whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on, everybody. Good one. Uh, Mom breaks the hotel room part eight. Look, I tied that bow. Isn't that cute? Oh, thank you. Here's You're thick. Bow tire. Here's the bow tire. Okay, this is our little tag. We can sit out here if we wanted to. Road Watch people side. walk in the, and yeah. Look at, so look at, oh, look at this view right here. Kate, come here, look at it. Isn't that pretty? Are you kidding this? <laughs> right? Yes, exactly. Yeah. Look at the thousand, the mountains, and that's yep. a golf course, and the trees are going that way. It's really very pretty. And more mountains behind your big head. Oh, okay. <laughs> And there's the, one of the pools. There's three pools. It's beautiful. So anyway, we're having a very good time. And we have not yet met the other members of Katie's um, Heart Squad. We're going to meet them in just a few minutes. But what you should do is if this you This is our see, beautifully clean hotel room. It is. It's not really beautifully clean. Yeah, that was a joke. Oh, sorry. But I want to tell you guys, Give if you dress. want to see the rest of Katie, like Katie's video of her vacation, am I too close? No. Of the Heart Squad and what she's doing here. Take a look there, but I'm not or there, but I'm not sure if it'll be up yet. So if it's not up yet, I apologize. If it is, then there'll be a little link either there or there. You can go see the rest of My it. My throat hurts. Can I take some medicine, please? Yes, you may, but that'd be the first medicine she's taken all day. That's good news. So she's getting better on the mono thing. We're gonna go have dinner with our friends. Bye. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, hello. I don't know what the last clip was. What was the last clip, Dad? Did they know we're here? I think so, yeah. Okay, so anyway, we went out of that. Uh, hotel. It had an amazing view, but it was not that great. Uh, so we came to a little bit of an upgrade. So uh, Mr. Hooper knows like this pro golfer, and uh, he owns this like resort. And we might have gotten a suite for free, and we might go golfing tomorrow. So I'm super excited for that. Anyway, uh, here we are. Well, I'm already inside. Uh, so here's the here's the room. Hey, Dad. So uh, we have the kitchen in here, full kitchen. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Uh, this countertop with a bunch of high chairs around it, so Brennan. Uh, also, do you guys like this wall? It's pretty, it's a pretty nice wooden wall, right? Wait, what's what's this? What's this? <gasps> oh, bang! It's a bed. <laughs> did not see that coming, did you? So I'll be sleeping there. Uh, also, there's everyone. <laughs> in Mr. Hooper's gotten into the robes. Uh, you beat me to it, don't it? Uh, but. <laughs> 
so everyone has their own queen. Like, there's five queens, I'm pretty sure. Uh, and a couch, if we need it. So, uh, yeah, anyway, we have Super Smash Bros. on the TV, right there. Fireplace, there's Ray. Uh, we have a really, really nice deck. <laughs> Overlooks. Look at that sky, it's amazing. Uh, there's two hot tubs down there. There's a pool, tennis courts, and a basketball court. Uh, just a little pool house. And then here's our other deck, so I don't know if you can see that that well. So, there's another room. This, this isn't it, ladies and gentlemen. This, this is not the whole thing. There's also in here, two queen beds, and that goes out to the other deck that I just showed you. Another TV. Bathroom. bathroom, beautiful bathroom. Wow. Amazing. Awesome. Hello. This is Uber. <laughs> this is Uber. Uh, there's another door. So we got, I think we got, I think we got two connecting rooms. So this one's the suite, and then that one's like the normal one. Uh, and then we have in here, this is actual, is actually a part of the suite. So there's another, I think it's a king bed, uh, closet, another bathroom. And then there's another bathroom over there. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the full suite tour. It is absolutely beautiful in here, and we absolutely love it here. So I think we're gonna stay here for a while. Uh, tomorrow, or we went to the grocery store, so we got food for the whole, like, four on yards. And anyway, yeah, so super excited to uh, spend a couple days here. With that last clip, we're just gonna do what made me happy today. happy today uh, was definitely getting here safely uh, we drove around Glacier National Park a little bit this morning and that was lovely uh, we had a really good breakfast Raymond uh, what made me happy today is AC AC, AC yes um, for sure because we didn't have AC in our last hotel room and the, the wonderful food today yes amazing daddy -o. Uh, what made me happy today was hey with boys. I love uh, just boys. Kind of with you guys and just everything we do. We just kind of hang out and talk, and it's really good. Yeah, fun. it is good fun. Yeah, miss miss the girls, but yeah. Yeah, really. <laughs> beat on. This hotel and um, the view at the lake. Yeah, yeah, it's beautiful. Uh, Mr. Uber, <laughs> you lost. Mike's driving. Eight <laughs> hours of flawless driving. Getting Let's go, safe. Mike. Hey, you, Mr. Uber. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to wrap it up. Also, look at this lamp. I just thought... This is cool. It's like, a tree, it's like a tree lamp. I just thought that was cool. Alright, I don't know if you guys know this about Katie, but she has a particular voice that she uses that everyone in her family mounts whenever she does it. And it makes it for dad. <laughs> Except for dad. No, he does too sometimes. So when she talks in that voice, we do whatever she wants. It's like a it's like kind of a you know trance. on it's a trance, right. I was gonna say, you know on the um It's like that one episode of Phineas and Ferb with Meep. Oh. Because like it's so Meep is so cute. Yeah, oh, and everybody does whatever he wants them to do? Me. Yeah. I was going to say, it's more, it's like um, the Jungle Book. And remember Ka, the snake, and he would talk and his eyes would go like this and you'd do it. Yes. All right, you guys, so we finished up with our dinner Why and our Lego so friends. Oh, I'm so sorry. We chose what? Yes. Katie's very tired. Not only is she jet lagged, but she's also still, I think, has some mono fatigue. So what made you happy today, baby girl? Oh, my gosh. Katie, what made you happy? Just meeting the other girls was really nice. They're super fun. Had a good dinner. Stuffed my face twice today. Oh my goodness. But I ate healthy stuff today, which I'm good, I'm glad about. Yeah. See, here's the thing. Actually, I'm not going to tell you. Okay. Good night, everybody. Good night. <laughs> what made me happy today, you guys, was the same deal. I got to meet so many new friends. I got to meet the moms of Katie's friends. So that was super, super duper fun. And we get to spend the day tomorrow together as well. So I'm really much, very much looking forward to that. And it made me happy that um, traveling with Katie is always fun. So we had such a good time traveling out here and being together um, at the pool and at lunch and on the plane and all that stuff. That was super fun. And hearing again what the boys are doing out in Montana. Montana and Idaho is so fun as well. So hope you guys had a wonderful day. Please comment below what made you guys happy today and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.